I'm Eric, I play the bass. I'm Darren, and I play the guitar as well. And I'm Steph, and I play drums. Cool, so my name is Carl, and I play guitar. I'm Simon, and I sing. And together, we're Diatessaron. Simon once approached me uh, as we were going to music school together at University of Calgary and said, I'd like to start a band. And at that moment, I thought, I guess we probably could start a band. And so then we did. Uh, we started originally as mostly a covers band, but then we started writing our own originals. Uh, really started with um, a couple original tunes that Carl had written for a previous band that he was involved in. That's, yeah. Yeah. That's all true. When we started out, we were actually a four-piece with uh, Carl and Darren kind of trading duties on bass, uh, but neither of them really liked playing bass, so we got Eric involved. <laughs> <laughs> Someone's got I guess. <laughs> Darren was taking some kind of a music class where, uh, where he was presented with some medieval music theory and, and diatessaron is one word that represents the perfect fourth and so um, he thought it sounded cool and um, we thought it was as good as anything else so we just kind of went with it and uh, in in a way it's it's kind of cool in a way it's hard to spell so you know <laughs> there's there's a trade-off there but hopefully people remember it now Like, a few of us have played in, in other bands in the past, and uh, we kind of had a lot of the same influences, and we listened to a lot of uh, old progressive rock and stuff like that, and so we were all kind of uh, writing, you know, those kind of tunes, and that's our sounds kind of came out of that. The song is, the song is called Kite Strings, and I, uh, I wrote that. Um, it's one of one of the more recent diatessaron songs that I've written. I, I feel like it it kind of came out of what Carl just said as us starting out as a, a prog rock band a little bit more, and then um, for me it, it kind of started to take a bit more pop influence as well, um, trying to trying to get the prog rock elements down into a more condensed form rather than these big ten minute songs. You know, putting it into uh, something a bit more catchy, a bit more accessible, and still having a lot of complexity. So. Um, Kite Strings is really just about, I don't know, being, uh, it's, it's, a, it's a hard lyric to describe, but it's, you know, the, the music itself is, is prog pop, I guess you could say. Uh, it's from the album Cobalt 60 Blue. It's actually not a full album. It's a four track EP. And we recorded it at uh, Taylor Sound, which is a studio run in Calgary by a man named Brad Taylor. Amazing fella. Uh, had a great time recording there. We did the whole four track thing uh, live off the floor in about a day, I think. Yeah, it was just like one day, probably, yeah, like pretty much an afternoon. And then it took us kind of forever. We did the mixing and mastering ourselves. And that, that took a while. But after about a year, actually, we finally got the thing done. So we recorded it in a day and mixed it in a year. I guess uh, we have yeah we have a website diatessaronband.com or that's diatessaronband.com. Um, so there's contact info through there. Our Facebook page. Um, I don't know what other Twitter. Twitter, Twitter yeah, the Gmail through the website is probably the easiest way to find it. So yeah, that's how you can get at us. Book us for shows. Buy our stuff. <laughs>